What's up guys? It is February 12th, Thursday, February 12th, and I got heavy deadlifts today, so I was thinking of just doing like kind of vlogs on the days of workouts. We'll see, we'll see what the response is, but um, I'm a little worried about the way and just um, hit all my macros. Drink water really late last night, so I don't know if that's going to have an effect on it. Drink almost all my water real late last night, so about a uh, little over a gallon, like towards the end of the night. So we'll see if that has an effect. It's going to be a shock to you as it will for me. Alright, not that bad. So 198.8. So started at 199.6, and I think I was at 198.6, so I gained 0.2 pounds. But that's just uh, for those of you who have not lost weight consistently, um, or on a consistent basis, I should say, that's how weight loss goes. So it's not just all downhill, sometimes it's back and forth. Point uh, two pounds is nothing I'm worried about, but that's where I'm at. Yeah, a point two from last time. All right, I'll check in with you guys over breakfast. Okay guys, so I double checked and I'm actually from last time I actually uh, weighed in, which was yesterday. I didn't make a YouTube video about it, but I did make an Instagram. I was 198.4, I was 198.8 today, so almost half a pound up. Uh, I'm about halfway done with my cardio for the week. My goal is 900 calories for the week. Uh, but it might increase just a little bit uh, this coming week because as I said I'm going to be uh, taking like a week of a deload off I'm going up to my uh, mock like working up to the mock meet so my uh, da total daily energy expenditure basically how many calories I'm burning a day is going to drop significantly because I'm not going to be working out like I normally do. Anyways, I just wanted to share that with you guys real quick. Uh, and then breakfast we got going. We got the coffee and eggs and that nature's, I think it's nature's harvest bread. If you guys are dieting and you're not, and you don't have that bread, like I said, it's, sm it's small, but does the job for two slices it's six fiber six protein and only 17 carbs so that's that's pretty good and then in the eggs I got um, I just sliced up two slices sliced up two slices of ham and kind of like let that sit in the pan a little bit before so if you're dieting and you want bacon that's a good alternative or even turkey bacon, which will be less fat as well. So try that out if you are dieting. Going to uh, start a new book today. It's a short read, but uh, I have an option of three different books. So you guys let me know what you think. But one of them is called Motivation and Goal Setting. Basically, how to set up. Gold's better. One is called A Winning Attitude. And then the last one is called The One Minute Manager, which is the one I'm leading towards. Basically just um, how to manage your time a little bit better, which uh, I don't know anybody out there that couldn't take advantage of that. But if you guys have read any of those, let me know. So a friend suggested these three to me and let me borrow them and said pick one and 
and read it. So I think I'm going to go with the one minute manager. I'm going to start that today and hopefully finish it within a week. Uh, yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys. I don't know. So I'll just see you when I see you. It's a celebration, bitches! What's up, guys? 10 o'clock at night, and I'm barely heading to the gym. Another late night. Um, big day today. Got 490 on dead. And, uh, yeah, I didn't, I didn't do anything out of the ordinary. No refeed. Nothing like that. I did take a long siesta before going. So that's uh, that's part of why I'm late. Something I am going to be doing different is I'm taking this, well, it's just this kind of new pre-workout or something I got from Fit Expo. So it's Hyde, right? Nothing crazy. It looks like it's got a, it actually looks like it's got a pretty cool uh, opening, so I'll make sure to record that for you guys. But the thing that is different about this is if you look at that, hopefully you get enough focus. It's got over 400 uh, milligrams of caffeine in it, and I had to double check with a friend just to uh, just to make sure but um, to give you an idea of how much caffeine is in this bitch uh, this is around like 90 milligrams and a cup of coffee so that's got 419 yeah so I'm gonna be bouncing off the walls uh, I brought some rice cakes oh there they are Brought some rice cakes with me just to kind of get some carbs in before I go. Um, probably, probably ate about a little bit more than half of my carbs uh, up until these rice cakes. So hopefully this will just kind of fuel, fuel me a little bit more, get me through the workout. Uh, I am a pretty firm believer in um, having you know, having a decent meal before you before you go lift. I don't think it's necessary. Uh, I feel that it does help when the weights are getting uh, fairly heavy, but then again, I do believe that your mind is much stronger than anything. So I have like PR'd on empty stomach and on ridiculous calorie reductions like sudden ridiculous calorie reductions as well so uh, you know mind over everything I'm about to open this pre-workout <laughs> I'm a little uh, little intimidated nah I'm not intimidated pre-workout's my thing that's what I do alright so here we go it says peel push shake Again, here it is. So peel. Push. Oh, it's dropping in there. Oh, shit. It's dropping in there. Shake. I'm excited. Fruit punch. Alright. Let's see. Tastes like fruit punch. Alright, I'll check in with you guys in a bit. Once it kicked in. Gotta finish my mobility. See you in a bit.
All right, guys. So I got one. Uh, the, the program uh, prescribed one to four. I got one. I was, you saw, I was gonna go for a second one, but uh, I mean, I didn't feel like Snap City was coming, but my lower back got like tight quick. Uh, so, you know, t today's not the day I'm, I'm testing my strength. It's uh, the very last day. So, you know, I'll, I was gonna go for another one and, and possibly grind that shit out or just fry my CNS. So it's one, one or the other. One or the other was gonna happen. Uh, but you know, watching it over, it looked like it looked like that was it for me. So I'm gonna be. Uh, I'm gonna just do some um, reverse hypers real quick and and then get out of here and then rest. Um, from here on out, from here till about a week. So, uh, I'm not angry, uh, I'm not satisfied, so, um, yeah, I, I'm not sure. My back just got really tight and, yeah, I don't know, it's, it's really hard to explain, but watching it over is, uh, a, uh, something else I noticed while watching it over is that it kind of got away from me. Um, maybe like right below my knees and I think that took out a lot of my energy so I'm assuming my lats weren't tight um, I gotta watch it again from a different angle and see if that's it in fact what happened but uh, oh, I might get some I might get some uh, some of this other stuff recorded but that's it. Um, that's you guys have followed me. If you have followed me, thank you for the last six weeks. So uh, now it's just time to rest, recover, sleep well next week, and you know just go into that meat setting and uh, you know get my eight hours every day and rest and recover from here on out. All right, guys. I'll see you. Uh, I'll see you when I see you.